Dr. Satwant Kaur is known as the First Lady of Emerging Technologies. She has provided content for hundreds of keynotes, seminars, workshops, and interviews on a wide variety of technology subjects, including a keynote at the 2013 International Conference on Consumer Electronics. Dr. Kaur is currently a Master Solution Architect with HP and has previously worked with Intel, Tibco Emerging Technologies at CTO, Symantec, Allstate, and more. Her education includes a bachelor degree in technology with distinction from Indian Institute of Technology, Delhi, a master's in computer science from Oakland, and a PhD in mobile internet protocols from Oakland. Here is Dr. Cower speaking about next generation applications for tablets. It's a wonderful time we all are living in today, uh, especially because this year, 2013, is going to be marked more by the tablets and the apps that bring green light into the tablets. So I took this opportunity to use this uh, moment to share with you that snapshot in time. So, uh, you know, when we talk about tablet, five years ago we used to think about stone tablets from the Bible. So I put that in the picture. And five, five years ago nobody knew uh, what a tablet computer was. And today we are in a place where IEC 2013 forecasts that we will have 173 million units sold this year. So that's amazing. It is amazing not so much that it is the tablet or it's the apps that's doing all the things, but it's amazing how technology is transforming our lives. It has revolutionized the consumer market and apps have been a central part of that. So what I want to do today is to do three things. Talk about what is this revolution of apps. And then what, what, what do the next gen apps look like? Dr. Kaur speaks about super hydrophobic nanotechnology for liquid proofing tablets and smartphones. Okay, so next one. This was again my big pain, right? And I think each of my phones died in the same fashion. I, I live in California, it rains there. Either they get wet in the rain or they just drop off. Or I, I spill coffee on it. Or I drop it in somewhere in the bath or in the sink. So my life is filled with moisture all around it. Why can't my devices get over it and accept the fact that this is a liquid pool and not uh, throw off it every time they get wet? So that's a pain. So I put this. This is a liquid water. We actually want waterproofing. They say waterproofing, but I put liquid proofing because I, I drink tea, coffee, all those things. So liquid proofing. That's why I, I put this in my vision because I wouldn't want to have a device that wasn't liquid proof. In, in future. If we are going to build something, we are going to build, a, build it like that. So it has a super hydrophobic uh, nanotechnology. So hydrophobic, it hates water and it's nanotechnology. And the company, it is strong. As you can see, you know, it's a device that's so wet, you can see it, it's got bubbles on it, but it wouldn't let any moisture go through whatever coating it has. So you can set, see from the picture that it's uh, the companies we pick up, and they, this is a true or liquid proof nano coating that they have. So it is a liquid re repellent microscopic coating. It has to be microscopic. And after the application, the beauty is it lasts forever. You, you've done it, uh, and you have applied it, and you don't have to deal with it anymore. It becomes a part of the device. It's almost virtually untraceable. You can't even tell it is there unless you saw a button on it. Uh, it does not comprise, and the beauty is it doesn't com compromise the look, the feel, or the performance of the tablet. So that's an exciting uh, technology. Dr. Cower speaks about social media and mobile and interactive television technology. Why do they not say it? How many of us got in difficulty with things that you shared but which show up decades later maybe? So, the problem that Facebook and Instagram have, have had, because once you share anything, you get into privacy and legal issues around that. So, you can share pictures, but the history is not stored forever. The fragment only remains in people's head. So, this is again another one. I picked TV on tablet. I talked about the enjoyment. This is a RCA application. Of course, RCA, because RCA does TV. So, it's a mobile application. It has dual TV tuner, 8-inch display. It has an ARM processor in it, and it, you can watch 4-hour mobile TV on this. 
With four patents, more than 50 media features within the last year, 20 distinguished awards, 20 years of experience with Fortune 100 companies, academia, national technology labs, and more, Dr. Cower, the first lady of emerging technologies, is a valuable resource for any technology keynote, seminar, workshop, or interview. If you are interested in talking with Dr. Cower, please contact her by visiting satwankower.com.